Okay, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to download a week in Paradise Forever. This will work for those of you that have the DLC on Paradise Lost and those of you that don't have the DLC. So anyways, let's get right into it here. So first, download the link and after that, follow the instructions. So let's get right into it here. So pretty much, once you download the RAR file from the Google Drive link, it will lead you to this forever uh, folder. That is, if you extract it using a free program like 7-Zip or WinRAR. Then you can um, highlight, right click, and hit properties. And you should have roughly around 301 files and 11 folders. And now you want to open, um, you also want to open your Postal 2 Complete from your Steam. And make sure to make copies too for both of, the, of these uh, files because in case you mess up, you know, you can always, you know, copy and paste as opposed to re-downloading and downloading over again. So for those of you that don't have the DLC, um, I want you guys to follow through. For those of you that do have the DLC, I will, um, I will work with you guys later on. So let's get right into it here. So for this is for those of you that don't have the DLC, by the way. So for those of you that don't have the DLC, let's just pretend that this never existed. And all you want to do now is you want to essentially drag the AWP Forever file that you extracted and drag it into your Postal to complete. And then you want to double click, go to System, and then click on the AWP. And make sure this is the EXE. You can go. You can do that by right clicking and hitting Properties. And now let's launch the game. Okay, so assuming that everything works, your AWP folder should open the game and it should pretty much load correctly. Now for those of you that don't have DLC, and for those of you that get the error saying like, oh, uh, codec you can't be found or entry can't be found, um, I suggest you guys keep watching the video because I have another solution for those of you that, um, that can't get this on first try because I followed exactly from what the Steam developer said, or the Steam creator, what he or she wrote, and it didn't work. So for those of you that are having this issue where you know you follow the instructions and it still doesn't work and it gives you the same error over and over again, you basically have to copy and paste the uh, modded folders, or I'm sorry, you have to copy and paste the uh, base folders into the modded folders. So you want to get rid of AWP forever. And what you want to do is you want to get rid of four of the following folders. I want you to get rid of workshop content, and by get rid of I mean just drag them all and you can throw them back in later on. Workshop content, share the pain, cache or cache, and empty steam the pot. I want you to drag these out, drag them out here. And then after that, what you want to do is you want to copy common redis. Copy this, copy this, and paste it into here. And then after that, for the animations, you're going to do the same thing too. You're going to copy and paste all of the files and drag them into here. And you're gonna do this for every single one of them for for karma data. Same thing, copy and paste, copy and paste, copy and paste, and etc. and etc. and etc. And then when you're done, what you want to do is you want to drag back all of the stuff that you removed from your base game and drag them back into here. And now all you want to do is you want to essentially um, assuming that everything uh, or assuming that you have copy and pasted everything into the files, I want you to exit it. And I want you to uh, make sure that everything is correct on a new folder. So you can right click and go to properties. And it should have roughly around 976 files and 18 folders. And now you pretty much do the same thing. You go to system and you click on the awp.exe, make sure it's uh, exe. And you double click and it should work for sure this time. And now, with that being said, that should be a video for those of you that don't have the DLC on how to do it. There are two solutions. Uh, one being very, very lucky and very, very unlikely, and the second being more of the one that works 100%. So once you get to this main menu here, you want to hit Escape, and you want to hit Quit Game, and hit Yes. And this should pretty much take you into the full version of Puzzle 2, the loading screen that you see in the vanilla version, and on the DLC, I believe, and on the modern version. So that's for those of you that don't have the DLC, um, I just showed you two ways on how to fix it. I I would recommend the second way, the one where you copy and paste, that one works for me all the time. And the other one, the one that worked the first time was just pure luck because I kept doing this over and over again. And somehow I finally just got fed up and I guess it finally worked. 
Okay, so with that being said, um, now I'm going to do a video, or now I'm going to do the tutorial for those of you that don't, or I'm sorry, for those of you that have the DLC Paradise Lost. So for those of you, so for those of you that have the DLC, this is actually going to be a lot easier, because what you want to do is, you're just going to drag the AWP file. So let me pull it up again. I'm going to drag the AWP file, or AWP forever, and you're just going to drag it onto the Steam version and that's what you're going to do and then you're just going to go to AWP close this too by the way maximize this go to system and go to AWP.exe and this one will work for sure I don't know if it's because I've been doing it over and over again or something like that but I think with the DLC I believe it works 100% and for those of you that don't have the DLC you're going to have to you know either copy and paste which is the most likely option so with that being said, um, there are basically two methods for those of you that don't have the DLC Paradise Lost and there is only one method for those of you that have the DLC, which I believe is much easier. So I'm not trying to say that you should buy the DLC because there's obviously another method. Um, so try out of amount and see which one works. But before you try out of amount, like ask yourself first, do I have the DLC or do I not have the DLC? Because if you don't have the DLC, then you're going to have to, you know, do a little bit more of a manual installation process whereas if you do have the DLC it's just going to be drag, open system and boom it should work you know it should work perfectly so with that said thank you for watching my video and if none of these work I will I will do a shorter tutorial version however it's going to be much much quicker and the file will be like 13 or 14 years ago so yeah thanks for watching my video and that's all for now